Howdy boys and welcome back to Wargame Red Dragon long 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 awaited by a lot of you I'm assuming we're going to start off the second Korean war campaign in War game Red Dragon. Now, really quickly before we're gonna get going, I'm gonna try and finish this campaign, hopefully win. Um, whatever happens, if I win or lose, it doesn't really matter. Uh, because after that, I will ask Davidson if we can do another co-op campaign, the last campaign in uh, Airland Battle. And after that, I will redo Bear vs. Dragon because I only won that one on like this final, final, final day. Um, that was still when I was trying to get into War Game Red Dragon and I didn't have a clue what was going on. So I'm going to try and redo that. Uh, and then, whether I, if I fail Second Korean War, I'll redo the Second Korean War. But that will be a way down the line. Um, obviously, I did this in a heroic victory. I did this to the best of my efforts. And this one, I basically beat completely besides one unit that almost fucked me over at the end of the game. And I'm just gonna say that that's like a, like a complete victory to me. Uh, anyway, with the Second Korean War, um, this first episode will just be the naval battle that you're forced to play in round one. Uh, specifically, just that, because I want some of your feedback uh, when we're in the game, looking at the map. Uh, but yeah, I guess we'll just have the cinematic, and after that we'll take a look at the stuff on the battlefield. So, talk to you in a second. November 9th, 1989. The Iron Curtain cracks apart while Soviet troops in Germany remain in their barracks on Mikhail Gorbachev's direct orders. 1991. When the Warsaw Pact is disbanded, influential party, army, and KGB members concerned about an imminent dissolution of the Soviet Union decide to overthrow Gorbachev. August 18th to the 19th, 1991. Activating a state emergency plan the rebellion leaders arrest Gorbachev, Yeltsin, several liberal deputies, and anyone suspected of opposing the coup. August 21st, 1991, a state committee of the state of emergency, composed of the Putsch leaders, is created to manage the country. End of August, 1991. Although the defection of former Warsaw Pact members can't be undone, the strategic naval bases in the Baltic states are quickly and violently reoccupied. Autumn 1991, left almost alone to face NATO in Europe, the USSR initiates a diplomatic switch towards its last communist neighbors, China and North Korea. Early 1992, in order to seal the new friendship with its Asian allies, the USSR agrees to secret deliveries of some of its most advanced weaponry. April 1992. The military buildup in Asia has not gone unnoticed among UN troops. Units are put on high alert along the DMZ, and the USS Enterprise is sent to patrol the Sea of Japan. April 15, 1992. An explosion of unknown origin strikes the USS Enterprise's stern, rendering her motionless, while a Soviet squadron is sailing in her direction. All right, so that was obviously the intro to this campaign. Now, don't worry. A lot of people actually asked in previous campaign, like, intros, or like the whole movie thing. Like, did, that was not real life. That's like an alternate reality to what actually happened. Okay, so, um, I'm not a person that likes to read all this stuff. Honestly, I'm just gonna give it like a five second thing so you can read it yourself. You can pause the video if you can't read quick enough. Um, but I'm assuming you all can read. It doesn't really add anything if I read these things. So uh, I know that um, I have to defend the USS Enterprise. Um, basically, it's like the, you're forced to play that battle in a campaign. And if you lose, here, if you lose the Enterprise, um, you lose the campaign. Or at least, I, as far as I can remember. Um, Basically, what it, what they're saying is you can, if, as long as you do not have like a total defeat, it counts as a victory in this. So you can basically lose a lot of units as long as you still like, you know, don't 
get totally destroyed. All right, so we have to defend the Enterprise over here in a second, but uh, first, let's go to the map. All right, so, um, I am kind of scared. Um, this is a very big map, um, and I have some ideas of what I need to do, for example, with this one, with this one. Um, now, I want to move this one down or uh, up to and it really depends what's gonna happen in this battle if i can kill if i can kill one or two of those sovereign minis because uh, they only have four if i can kill one or two of them i'm not going to use this one but in the end i i want this to be secure i don't want these guys to sneak around so i either need these guys to cut them off or I need these guys to cut them off and just to reinforce um but if i don't like stop these guys i cannot uh, send reinforcements from japan which is a big thing. And another thing is um, defending on the mainland. And I honestly just want to push in with some units like these infantry specifically. So you can hold this and get the airplanes back so they don't get destroyed and everything. Um, I'm already starting to lose uh, my mind at the look at this map. And I've looked at this map multiple times. Like especially when I was like just starting to play the game. And then this map would just give me like all sorts of panic attacks and everything. Well, not really obviously, but pretty damn scary there's a naval invasion force over here um so there's a, there's enough for me to do uh, in the coming uh, in the coming well weeks uh so any tips tricks you know, uh, comments are very welcome uh because i'll definitely need your help so without further ado let's get into naval sector kilo's battle all right let's go back and then um 5,000, they have MiGs, they have Edge 27Ks, I have 14 Tomcats, and I have Super Hornets. All right. Also, I'm very interested to see how many of you people are, like, interested in a new campaign. Because I've been, obviously, a lot of people have been asking about this, but it's always hard for me. Because, you know, if five people are very vocal about this, it doesn't mean everybody wants it. So, let me know in the comment section or, like, give a like to the video so I have an idea of, like, what's going on. Like, how, like, how, like, hyped you guys are, I guess. Like, I, I have no idea. Like, I just saw, like, a lot of people asking for it. But that doesn't necessarily mean... That, that's actually a lot of people because if if there's like 10 or 5 people that make a comment in every video <clears throat> And are like very vocally about it that to me almost like you know it, it's hard to explain But I guess you, you guys know what I mean. So we're gonna go for a very basic defense I want to have these colon points secured. That's all I'll need an OHP for those all of ours are parry OHP uh, I'm gonna put my Congo quite far forward now what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna call one oh, one and two my Congo will be in support. Actually, I want this Congo to be back here. Right. So this will be my defense. Um, I do have enough points for a helicopter, which I kind of want to get, just so I can get the uh, the scouts off, because he has a he has very good uh, exceptional uh, exceptional sea optics. So that's something that I'm really uh, needing right here. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get 150, 65 points. I'm going to get Charlie, and then I'm going to put a, uh, an OHP here, and then just try and lock down this northern path. If I can make sure that all the enemies come across this northern path, northern, nor northern, northern path near uh, Delta, um, I can start locking them down. Calling airstrikes from the back, calling in helicopter runs. I really like like simultaneous helicopter attacks. It can be quite effective, actually. So uh, I guess we'll see what happens. So wish me luck. This I'll definitely need it. All right. Uh, let's see. This away and there and there and there. And now, yeah, like I said, 165 points. We're gonna get Charlie, and then we're gonna go from there. And we just spotted the Muna. If I can destroy 120 point Muna with my ship uh, helicopter missiles, I will not say no to that. Um. I know I don't have a lot of spotting range down here, but that's I did that on purpose because I don't want the Oliver Hazard pair to get sniped by like someone over there. See, I just don't like, like that to happen. There's a Muna right there. Can we get a shot on that guy? There's two Munas actually here, I think. Yeah, there's a second one. Oh my god, if I could kill a Muna right away, that'd be fucking hilarious. I'm pretty sure he's on hold fire. And we're at 120, almost at the Oliver new, new, new OHP. And we'll drop him in Charlie in a couple of seconds. And um, we'll be able to get some more points per minute. And boot. Oh, no, almost. Oh, wait, stop. 
stop, 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 stop. Don't, don't die. All right, all of parry go in uh, over here, corner. All right, now. Sky is ours. Can we kill it? There we go. Missiles away. I think the thing they're firing forget. Yep, they are. Oh, Muna's already dead almost. That's good. That's at least a damaged ship. Uh, let's stick around here and try and do some recon uh, for up north. Here comes my OHP. I really... Okay, the, the bulk of their force seems to be over here. They have a submarine over there. They have probably another one. Let's see if I can get some more spots going on with the... Uh, Seahawk, I think it is. I used to play a game called Sonar Sonalist Com... D no, not DCS, but like... Um, it was called something else. But basically, you were like, able to control like a all rise of parry and able to control like the uh, helicopters on board at uh, the all, all rise of parry and stuff. It was a really cool game. Oh shit, I got three silver minis right there. Those fat fucks. Um, not not the shit, like not the people, but like the the, sh the ships are pretty fat fucks. The ships. All right, let's get this OHP up here in that case. And I think they're not going to fall for this trap. Seeing as this guy, well, we'll see, maybe. Let's do some more recon up here. Okay, we already have a case 27 PL. Never mind, K27 PL is down. That's good. I want to keep an eye out though. I'm gonna just okay. There's one silver mini right here. I really want to come across this northern side or this southern one. Either one. I just need to know where. That's the most important. Okay, there's over Terran tool firing him all over to Harry Perry. And don't get shot. Nail down, please. There we go, nice. That's not gonna do anything. Oh, fuckers. I need another All Lord Hazard Parry here soon. Uh, if I can get one of those server minis, like, separated from everyone else, that would also be very amazing. Would not even. I do need to set some more defenses up there. I'm gonna try and call all my uh, OHPs out first, because that's like my mainline ship. It's like my medium tank ship. All right, here comes a Tarantul. Kinda wanna kill that with a F-18, or like at least damage it, but that's not gonna happen probably. Uh, okay, let's, there's a silver mini over there. Let's get them to recon back over there up north. If these ships go south, I'll have to go south myself. The Tarantul's gonna pop up in a second. However, I do have enough shippies. Wait, that's not smart. That's gonna get you killed. Oh well. Who am I? Who am I, right? Who am I? Oh, you get wrecked. Assuming you're gonna get wrecked anyway. It's, it's very short range for a missile. If you can fire the missile at this guy, it's gonna die. Oh shit, it's gonna die. Oh, I got both missiles. Oh my god, such luck. Wow, that was awesome. Alright, let's get the other, other OHP down here, hopefully. Is he firing in my butt? Yes, he is. Okay, well. Got some chamseries. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Let's get this Oliver Hazard Perry back here before he gets killed. Oh, God. No, don't explode. Don't explode. Oh, God damn it. Ah, fucker. Well, that sucks. That really sucks that uh, Oliver has a parry team killed his own friend there. Oh lord. Alright, well. Um, two Pegasus would probably. Nah, I need to. Let's kill this helicopter if we can. Come on, fire and miss. And fire. And hit and destroyed. Nice, okay. Helicopter is in here. Somebody's in range. Everybody's in range. Every ship's opening fire right now. I want to get another uh, F-18. Two F-18s will probably do a lot of damage to a, uh, whatchamacallit, to a Silver Mini. Or at least enough damage, anyway. So I lost one I lost one OHP. Um, if I can kill a Silver Mini, that would be amazing. I would not mind trying to go after this guy with just two F-18s and then hoping this guy doesn't die. Which he will probably do right now, because that's going to be very close range with the 130s for the 76 mils. 
the nine. Let's get these planes out here then, and hopefully... Okay, we're damaging him. Okay, Chems Ridge are taking missiles, but that's what they're supposed to do, because they can mow him down with the uh, Cheese Whiz, CRWS. Alright, let's get this over here, and then let's do the Silver Mini. Let's do a double attack with the Hornets. Keep my uh, CH-60 around. Alright, oh shiz. Oh shiz. Lots of champs to read. Here comes more planes. Oh, we just did that much on the. Uh, oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. Oh god. Uh, fuckers. Shit. All right. Uh, I gotta keep this uh, sovereign many now. However, the thing is, it's gonna spot people in my back. I just lost another champs to read as well, but it's gonna spot people behind. Well, it's gonna like get. Draw, it's gonna like, drop in behind me now. However, he is almost dead. Well, he's half dead. So what I can do. So buy another hornet, so we have three, and then I'll start spamming. Yeah, I get a, a third hornet. Then I'll get an OHP and strengthen this over here. This should be fine for now, and we'll just see what we can do. And then last but not least, I do want to spam some of those uh, guys in the um, uh, in the uh, CH sixties because they're pretty effective if used in like a volley of six. You can fire twelve missiles. Now, some many can take out. Five, six, seven, eight of those, but if four of those hit, that's still a nice, like, amount of missiles hit. And taking out eight for a summer mini by himself, by his lonesome, is also very, um, like, never gonna happen. Now there's like a helicopter versus helicopter, but they can't shoot each other, which is kind of awkward. It's like, what's up, boy? <laughs> this is, uh, this is kind of awkward. Um, what's up? <laughs> All right, well, let's, um, I'm gonna strengthen my, uh, okay, my things are almost done. Let's do this. Let's do it. Fly around, and then now we're going to make sure we're on his on his side, uh, on his uh, side. Okay, H twenty seven case broke off, and now we're going to do a massive attack run from the side. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. And go! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on. Okay, he took, uh, didn't lose anything. He took like four or five bars of damage, three, four or five bars of damage. I think his health was like up to here. So he did take half of his, uh, he's at like 25% of his health. Um, let's get some of these helicopters. I'll get another one of those because then I can uh, resupply them uh, using the, uh, no, no, I'll keep this guy, well, no, I'll keep this guy here for now. And then the next attack, he can come back. Because I'm going to use these five guys to attack the Sovereign Mini. And then after that, I will um, use them, all six of them. And call them this. And break them off into nope, two groups. And then hold fire. Go over here. And then we'll attack the Sovereign Mini from the side. Do lots of damage and be very happy. And oh, north, we're still doing okay. This guy needs a little bit more cover. I probably want to buy another champ to read. Just because I like having more ships, especially in my butt. I like having ships in my butt. That's a nice thing to say. And then we really need to deal with that shit. Okay, of course, this is what I wanted to happen. There's some big ships. Machine guns opening fire on me right now. That's not good. Let's get out of there before he gets raped. Alright, these ships are going out. We have the all right as a pick. What is this thing? Oh, it's just going to shoot our backs, isn't it? Oh, that's one of those fucking. All right, we need to deal with this guy first. I think we can. I think we. I think we can fire missiles on it. Yes, there we go. That would we'll probably kill him. Nice. 145 points. All mine. Now we just need to get him to side. He's by himself. He's a helicopter over here. The helicopter can't do jack shit for him. This thing will. Uh, I guess. I want to try and do it like somewhere where like I can always resupply, which should be over here. And then I want another Champseria. I need another Hull Rise Carry actually, I don't have anything. So I'm going to wait for a couple more points. Silver Mini is moving out, that's good, that's good. I'm going, he's sort of going to kill my Champseria because that's like a nut, like it's a literally like a piece of shit shit. But it's fine, he killed a helicopter, which basically means he already got the points back. Hold fire. Get in range, get in range, get in range. I'm not sure what his AA range is. Okay, 35. Oh, we can get a lot closer than that. Okay. All right, so hold. Stop. Stop for a minute now. All right, are we ready? 
Ready for the mass attack wave. Here we go. Open fire, boys. Hunting season is on. That takes that's worth a while. Sure. There we go. All right. Hold missiles away. That's two missiles down. Three, four, and he is down to two health. That's really damn good. So let's get this guy. Let's get all these guys back. And let's put this guy to uh, stop. And then we're going to get them all landed and ready. Another all rise of here would be nice. Let's get this guy get the fuck out of here. Let's. So fine. Oh shit! I did not mean to do that. That's stupid. Well, that sucks. I lost one of those uh, CHs. Well, shit happens, right? Nijin. I'm gonna wait for my third Super Hornet, and I'm going to buy some more Chancerys. This all rounds of pair is gonna go for the suicide, but I want him to get back so he can at least. Oh, what happened? Okay, never mind. I want him to get back. Um, he's almost dead. I want my Congo to fall back a little bit more. I need to get that fucking Sovereign Mini down. Fuck, I need, I need to send two right now before. I can't wait to send the third. I can't wait to send the third one. We might kill him. We might kill him. We just need like one rocket hit. Yes! There we go. And we also killed the helicopter? Oh, we did! Oh, uh, wrecked. All right. This OHP might survive now, which means we can call in... Oh, nice. And now we can call in my Hornet on that guy. These guys are... I need to start falling these guys back a little bit more. All right. I forgot to grab my choppers. I did lose one, which kind of sucks, but, you know, I can't have everything. Let's get, put them down on the floor and send my uh, Hornet after the night. No, never mind. He's going to die, probably. Oh, that's AA. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I was really close. There's actually... Fucking planes out of some of my house right now. It sounds pretty scary. All right, let's send one Hornet. It's pretty risky, but I'm assuming it can actually kill his Nigerian, which he's only one health, which would be pretty effect, pretty good use of stuff. Where do you need us, sir? Yeah, let's send him over there and then let's do it. As long as this, this OHP will probably die, <laughs> but it's a risk I'm willing to take. Okay, misses away, and yes! Oh shit, Migs! Oh god! Oh god! Oh run! All right, this is all fine. I don't want to lose my Congo. That's all I want. I don't want to lose my Congo. It's very important to me. This, uh, this, this OHP just committed suicide. It just went all the way over there for some reason. I'm not sure why. Um, all right, this OHP, and then these guys can go back up. Hold fire. Lost an OHP. That's fine. Life sucks. Uh, get a guy here to start repairing people. Um, honestly, I want to actually fall back to here if I can. I'm gonna, I'm gonna abort Delta. Delta will be uh, will be for them. There's not much I can do about that. Set up some Pegasus though, if I can. Set up some nice rocket ships. These Pegasus are like skiffs, I think, because they're not like really anything but other than that. I think they're skiffs, which like they're like floaty something. Look at this, like they float kind of things. Yeah, see. Right, let's see if we can take take down this K27. I lost another champ three. I just wanted this, I didn't need these guys to survive. Survive! Oh, I should did not pay attention to that, and I just lost. That sucks. They just made me to hell. Oh, oh, that was not really worth it, but I did manage to get two MIGs down. Nice, good fucking shooting. Probably the Congo that raped that other MIG. 10 out of 10, that's actually turned to be out to be, I guess, decently worth. I'll be there soon. Right now, these guys need to get the fuck back because they're about to be destroyed by stuff. Okay. Let's fuel turn you off. Let's see if we can uh, just kill one of these uh, Nijins. If we can kill one Nijin, and we can return and get another Nijin, then that's pretty damn good. Let's hold fire. Probably kill that ship right now. Fire the second one. If we kill, nah, that's not. That's not gonna kill. Nah, you know, actually, one. Yeah, he needs one more rocket. I can just send my uh, uh, things after him though. My. Uh, hey, don't don't replenish ammo though. That's not really what you're trying to do there. 
Fire one away, two away, four away. He's, he's dead. More points, that's good. We did kill one or two of the silver minis already. I think we killed one. Trying to repair these ships as good as bad as I can. And we need another LCU. These guys can land. His OHP is fine. Let's get a, a Pegasus right here just to clear this area. These Pegasus are fine. Gem Serene needs to go in front of the Congo. It's only the Congo really holding this flank right now. That's fine. Someone Helicopters, uh, put them on hold fire. Get their missiles reloaded. I love, I love seeing the actual missiles like be reloaded on the thing. There we go. That's two. The captain and his crew welcome you aboard. There we go. All right. They're all ready. We can engage the second night gym. We could just keep killing them. Um, we did lose a couple of OHPs. We did decide to lose a, uh, a thingamajig. We lost a... Um, how you call that? A, uh, I'm all here. Uh, how do you call that? We did decide to lose a thingamajig. Uh, an F-18. There we go. Sorry. Oh, no, I lost my friend in there for a second. Right, Pegasus is going to engage. Engage, please. He's going to die. He's dead. He can never survive that. There you go. Oh my god. The amount of spam from those Pegasus. God damn. That was insane. All right, love, why don't I just do another Pegasus thing? Why does it always have to be me? I don't think I've ever done that. Let's get all these Pegasus together in like a nice line, and we'll just attack with them. This guy did definitely did not supply fuel or a point. Hold it, just uh, stuff should secure over here. This chip so we can go here and then power for the There you go. Let's call the kill a Kamar. Send two hornets over here. These guys can land. We got one minute. We got less than two minutes left. Um, let's see if we can get more points, though. I really want to kill a moon or not a Terran tool. That'd be really good. Silver mini up there. Let's, get, let's see. If hopefully, we can kill another Terran tool. Misses away. Misses away. That's probably, that's probably him going to die. Almost dead. That's worth. All right. Ship. Helicopter's ready. Right, let's make sure they're on hold fire. Okay, there's not a lot of ships, lot of ships coming towards me right now. Let's see if we can... Uh, oh, God, I really want to try that. If we can fire a, that, like, such a large amount of rockets at a silver mini, that could probably kill them. Chemseries are covering my Congo. I'm pretty happy my Congo's still alive so far. Let's get two Tomcats for now. I Well, I'll get a second one in a second. I really want to be an asshole and put a, uh, another ship in here so I can at least capture it. So I can, if I have to fight her again, which will probably happen, I can at least um, re get, like, respawn there. If that makes sense. That makes sense to me. Don't, don't worry about it. Where do you need us, sir? I'm going to try and engage that Terran tool if I can. Things don't have any uh, C I W S though, which kind of sucks. But I at least can fire back. Helicopters is, might kill someone. Want to kill a Tarantula? Kill it. There you go. Another, another four, 145 points. And we're about to kill a Tarantula. Come on. No, we just might not kill it. Come on. What? How are all missing? You're, you're all, well, I lost two. That's okay. I did my job. I did lose. Yes! I did lose. Okay, I lost two Pegasus right there in the bottom. But again, like I said, risk I was willing to take. 3,730 versus 1,235. 1, I lost uh, two OHPs. I lost a Hornet. I lost a couple of Chumseries. I lost one Helicopter. And I lost two Pegasus. But I did kill uh, one Silver Many, two Silver Menis, and uh, a lot of Nijin. So that's really damn good. So that means that we survived. Okay, so they repelled the attack. So now... Um, we will, uh, all right, well, basically we just need to, uh, we can either go for a pre pre preemptive strike or we can sit back and fall back, but 
Uh, that's where I need your advice and your tips. That's where I'm gonna probably cut it after this. Well, cut it short after this. Uh, the, after this part in the video, just to look around. So I've got 20. That's not a lot of like points I can call on this Japanese flotilla with like four more Congos. Now this, if I was to do something, what I would do was I would call out. Wait, what is this? Oh, anti. Okay, never mind. I would call in either this, the these tram intruders because they have the four missiles. That's really damn awesome, actually. Holy shit. Um, so I would either call, what is this? Okay, free fall bombs and then these prowlers. Okay, I would either call in this or I'd call in these guys because these guys have the Congos and um, these planes are actually also not that. They're basically like little all over, all over hazard parries without the possibility of like cap capturing zones. But I, um, I will need some advice, especially on the naval stuff. Like I want to move these guys up here and I want to move, what is this? Okay, fuck, four utiloids. Yeah, I would need this to go here and then send these guys left, I don't know. I honestly have no clue, and this is gonna be a very long campaign, probably a lot of stress for me, so I hope you guys will enjoy. Don't forget to stay awesome, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in episode two. Cheers.